So after trying so many free AI video and image generators, I finally came across this one. And let me tell you, it's just like Sora AI, which is incredible because the quality is absolutely top notch. I mean, take a look at these images. Now check out these videos. As you can see, they're super realistic and high quality. It's almost like magic, but without the wizard hat. But wait, that's not all. I'm also going to show you how to make money from the AI content you create. Yes, you heard me right. Your AI creations can actually earn you real cash. You'll be using an OnlyFans alternative called DFans. Don't worry, it's totally legit and it's perfect for creators like you. And because I'm a nice person or maybe an AI in disguise, I've also put together a document packed with free image and video generators. I keep updating it regularly so you'll always have the newest tools ready to go. Now, if you want that document, it's super easy. Just like this video, subscribe to my channel and comment, I want the document. My AI assistant will check if you've done everything and then send it straight to you. All right, without any further ado, let's dive right in. Google Image Gen. Open your browser and go to ChatGPT. Then ask it to write a description of a beautiful woman. If you have any features you'd like her to have, like hair color, skin tone, or style, make sure to include them in your message. Once you're ready, click send. When ChatGPT gives you the description, Ask it to create two prompts of her in a bikini. If it mentions a half-body shot, you can ask for a full-body shot instead. Next, ask for two more prompts of her wearing a dress. For me, I like variety, so I'll ask for two different dress styles. After that, we'll make the last two prompts, her selfies. Today, we'll be using Google's Image Generator to create our images. You might have heard of it before, but if you haven't, don't worry. We'll go through everything together, step by step. Before we start, let me tell you why I really like this tool. Google's Image Generator, like Imogen 3 and Pixel Studio, can create very realistic AI influencers. The faces look human, the skin looks smooth, the lighting is nice, and the poses look natural. You can even change their overall style, make them look fancy, relaxed, or artistic. It's simple to use and it keeps your pictures looking consistent, which is great if you're posting regularly. Plus, it has built-in safety features that let people know the image is AI generated. Basically, it helps you make digital influencers that look real and can post like real people online. Pretty cool, right? All right, let's move on to the fun part. Open a new tab and search for aistudio.google.com. You'll be taken straight to Google's AI Studio website. Now, once you're there, your screen should show the main interface. Don't get distracted by everything you see. Just look for the text box where you can type or paste your prompt. Next, go back to ChatGPT and copy your first bikini prompt. Then return to the Google site, paste it in, and click Generate. Wait a few seconds, and there it is. Your first image should appear. Wow. That looks great. The quality is really impressive. Let's go ahead and download it. Now, head back to ChatGPT. Copy your second bikini prompt, paste it into the Google site, and click Generate again. Wait for a few seconds, and your new image will appear. This one looks just as good. Let's download that one too. Next up, the first dress prompt. Copy it from ChatGPT, Paste it into the site and click Generate. These images just keep getting better and better. Let's download this one as well. Now for the second dress prompt. Go back to ChatGPT, copy it, paste it in, and click Generate. Wait a few seconds. And... Wow. Maybe I spoke too soon because this one looks even better than the last. Let's download it. All right. Now let's move on to the selfies. Copy the first selfie prompt from ChatGPT, paste it into the site, and click Generate. Give it a moment, and your image should appear. That looks amazing. Let's download it. Finally, take the second selfie prompt, paste it in, and click Generate one last time. It might look a little similar to the first one, but that's okay. It still looks great. And that's it. You now have a full set of images created using Google's Image Generator. It's simple, fast, 
and gives you high quality results every single time. All right, so the second best free website I use is definitely Focus. And yeah, I know you've probably heard of it before. Sure, there are other good free sites out there, but here's the truth. Even though they can make high quality images, the consistency is usually low or just average. But Focus, it gives you everything for free. High quality images, and consistent generations every single time. Plus, it comes packed with a bunch of awesome features. You can get more done in less time. It's super easy to use, and it's beginner-friendly, too. The images it makes are really, really good, and it uses stable diffusion to generate them. It even comes with built-in tools you'd normally have to add yourself. Things like prompt enhancer, upscaler, in-painting, out-painting, and negative prompt optimization. The best part? It generates images really Really fast and they actually look very realistic all right here's how to use it first open a new tab and search for NAS works then click the first github link that appears after that click on repositories then click on focus fixed crashed the page will reload don't worry that's normal now scroll down until you see open in collab and click that the page will reload again and it should now look different next Find the play button and click it. Then click run. Anyway, you'll see a bunch of code start loading. It might look complicated, but just wait. In a few seconds or maybe a few minutes, a link with Gradio Live will appear. Click that link and Focus will open in a new tab. Once you're inside Focus, turn on Input Image Enhance and also turn on Advanced. Then choose Quality over Speed. After that, go to Styles. Search for hyperrealism and turn on art style, hyperrealism. Now go to ChatGPT, copy your AI's first prompt, then go back to focus. Paste the prompt into the box and click generate. Wait about two minutes for two images to generate. When they're done, both should look amazing. Download them. Then go back to ChatGPT. Copy the second bikini prompt and go back to focus again. Paste it, click generate, and wait for it to finish. Wow. That one looks great too. Download it. Wait for the second image to finish and download that one as well. Now go back to ChatGPT again. Copy another dress prompt, then head back to focus. Paste it, click generate and wait for it to complete. Nice, it looks amazing. Wait for the second image and download both of them. Next, go back again, copy the next dress prompt and paste it in focus. Click generate and wait patiently for it to finish. Hmm, this one might not be perfect, a little too much going on, but it still looks fine. Download it and once the second image finishes, Download that one too. And that's pretty much the process. Just repeat the same steps for the last two prompts. Once those are done, congratulations, you've finished all your focus generations. Now, we're ready to move on to the next step. Okay, so next, we're going to do image to video. And for that, we'll be using the best free image to video generator out there right now, Magi AI. It used to be called DID Gen Axo, but DID Gen isn't free anymore. So I looked around and found Magi AI. It's a video generation website that's super easy to use completely free and can make videos up to three minutes long. The wait time isn't bad at all. And even though not many people know about it yet, the videos it makes are really good. Almost as good as DID Gen, maybe even better. All right, let me show you how to use it. Once your images are ready, open your browser and search for magi.sand. That should take you to their website. If it doesn't, I'll leave the link below. When you're there, it'll probably ask you to sign in. Just sign in with Google. It's faster that way. After signing in, you'll get free credits. And if you visit the site every day, you'll keep getting more. So basically, it's free forever. Now click on New Project. You might see some of your old projects up there if you've used the site before. The page will reload, and then you'll see two options. One says, click here to upload a file from your device. The other says, click here to select a file from assets. We're going to pick the first one, click it, 
and upload the image you want to turn into a video. It might take a few seconds to upload. Once it's uploaded, you'll see a plus sign next to your image. Click that, and a little box will pop up where you can type your prompt. Write something simple, no need to make it fancy. You can also choose how long you want the video to be. I'll set mine to five seconds and pick variation one. Under that, make sure to turn on all the options, things like enhance prompt and high quality, then click start generation. While the first video is generating, I'll upload another image, add a prompt, and start another one. Now we just wait. The first one's done. And honestly, it looks really good. I'm going to download it. The second one just finished too. And it looks great as well. Nothing weird. Super clean. So yeah. Let's download both videos and move on to the next step. Dfans. All right, so next up, let's talk about monetization, turning your creativity into income. One of the best ways to do that is by using platforms made for creators. Like it's a place where people can safely share their work, Dfans, build a fan base, and get paid for their creativity. Think of it as a safe, all-in-one hub for creators, writers, artists, musicians, models, and educators. Now. What makes DFANS special is its reliability. On some other platforms, if your account ever gets flagged or banned, your money might be frozen. But with DFANS, your funds stay protected and your community stays connected. They've also added something really cool, a customizable AI chatbot. This chatbot helps creators engage with their fans automatically. It can learn your communication style, reply naturally, and help you manage conversations while you focus on making content. When used correctly, AI can make your page feel more interactive and personal. You can set up your chatbot's tone, responses, and personality so it sounds just like you, friendly, welcoming, and professional. Once it's set up, it'll handle messages, answer questions, and keep your audience engaged 24-7. Some creators have even shared how these AI tools helped them grow faster by keeping fans engaged and active while they were busy creating. The more consistent you are, the more your audience grows, and the more you can earn over time. So, let's walk through how to get started. First, open your browser and search for dfans.co. That's their current domain. Click on Become a Creator. Then, click Apply Now. You can continue with Google to make signing in faster. Next, fill out a few quick details. Your country, your username, and the kind of content you want to create. You can also link your social media accounts if you want. Once your profile is verified, upload your profile picture and banner image. Then, start posting regularly and interacting with your audience. Staying active and consistent is the key. The more often you post, the more people see your work and the faster your community grows. So remember, keep your uploads steady, respond to your followers, and use tools like AI chatbots to make your workflow easier. With time and consistency, you can build a strong brand and earn real income safely online. If you watched this video to this very end, don't forget to like and subscribe to support my channel.